Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Laura with Diamond Painting and Stitching with Laura and today we have an unboxing and we have an unbagging. And I think I'm going to start with the unbagging first. So we'll just set that one over aside. I got these all from Amazon. Let's see if I can get it open here. Oh, maybe. I think it was going to be much. There we go. All right. And the first one is called Six Color Flower. It is an 11 count. Um, I got it from the Special Cute store. And when I clicked on this, it says it's from ZMVA. I don't know if that's a manufacturer, but I don't think so after looking at it again. Um, it is 44 by excuse me 41 by 44 centimeters I paid ten dollars and ninety nine cents for it I ordered it the 31st of May yeah May and I received it today so it didn't take very long to get here it was shipped from Las Vegas and this is it and they just call it the six color flowers hopefully you can see that If they have a smaller picture, I'll show it to you. Here's the picture on the, the thing. It's of pansies, of course, my favorite. And it comes with the instruction booklet. And it is, let me see, 135 wide and 150 high. And it is from the company... It's Joy Sunday, of course. So we'll see how good this looks. Oh, it's got lots of pretty, pretty colors for those pansies. Not a whole lot of colors. Looks like 26 colors. Blues, a couple shades of blue, some greens, a couple shades of pink, and some orange. And it comes with, of course, the really good needles. And here's the other ones, the purple, black, yellow, blues, there's several shades of blue. There, I'll lay them down. Maybe it's easier for you to see them that way. We'll get that out of the way. Also comes with the front and back instructions like the others. And this doesn't look very big. Now, it's certainly not 44 by 41, so let's see what the actual print size is. Um, it is 13 and a quarter, which is 30, 33 and a half by oops, 30, 31 and a half. So it looks pretty plain and simple and, you know, straightforward. It does have, let me move it up a little bit, it has all of the uh, symbols down at the bottom. It says 17 colors, hmm. and I guess 18 through good Lord, 26 is right here in this little area, and then it has your back stitch colors listed, and the pattern's really clear. Let me put that thing down. But I just thought it was really kind of cute and pretty and, and simple-ish looking. And I liked it. Yeah. So let's see if we can get all this back together here. And I'll show you the next one. I'll put that in there so we don't lose track of what's going on. But at least it doesn't have 10,000 colors. And the next one. I'll put that over there. Is... The little um, cabin. Hang on, just a second. Let's see if I can shed some more light on it. There we go. Then I'll pick it up. There you go. It's like a little uh, greenhouse shed, you know, where you put your potting stuff. I thought it was cute. It's an 11 count. It says 56 by 42. 
It's also a Joy Sunday. Also shipped from Las Vegas. Those two came all together. It says Flower Cabin. I paid $18.60 for it. I got it from Joy Sunday Embroidery Cross Stitch Store. And it said when I clicked on that, um, it did say that it was by Joy Sunday. Has the instructions front and back, just like the other one. And let me see if I can get an up close picture of it. There we go. Isn't that pretty? I thought it was just really cute. And it looks like we'll have to do a little back stitching on that. And it comes with the instruction booklet. And it's so small that it's cut into four different faces. You remember my big one, it was done in like 6 to 10 or 12 or whatever. It was like, oh, holy heck. Lots of pretty colors. And it has 35 colors. It, if I can get it to lay down, has some really pretty greens and rusts. And then let me come across. And some pretty yellows and blues and lots of shades of green. And it comes with the two uh, needles, like I said. And then it has reds and purples and coral some more greens and tans and browns. Isn't that cool? And then we have the the thing, the canvas. It says it is 451 wide this way by 373 inches high and that means that it is ah, a little under uh, 13 inches one way and I'll give you some centimeters if I could just talk oh there goes my thing again by 18 which means it is oh it's about 46 centimeters in one direction and 32 and a half on the other direction but yeah I just thought it was really cute I'll turn it up this way maybe you can see it let me whoops push the wrong button that way the light won't shine behind it but yeah it's kind of big but it, I mean it's longer you know but I think it's pretty and it has the um the key running along the bottom and it also has a list for the French knots in the back stitch over here but yeah and the the thing is really clear as usual and does show you where the back stitching goes but I always look on my uh, pattern because it will show you and this will be way easier to follow than uh, what do you call it uh, the beaded you know you won't have to worry about it at all but there's a lot of uh, back stitching in there. But yeah, I thought that was really pretty. So we'll put this all back together so I know what goes with why. We don't want to get confused because it's that kind of a day. Okay, now I'm going to go set this over here just to get it out of my way for this other thing. And now we go to the box and I got this one um, from the Ling, L-I-N-G, and then the next word is purple. It's supposed to be 16 by 20. Um, I ordered it on the 18th, I think, and I received it, yeah, that's right, the 18th of May, and I received it on 6-5. And so that took 13 days. And it does come in three different sizes. It comes in 10 by 12, 12 by 16, or 16 by 20. And I did get the 16 by 20, if I can get it. Good Lord, look how thick that is. Jeez. They really used up their, their trash bag. Ah, can't get it past the corner. Hang in there, guys. Give me a sec. We're just going to cut it right down there. I thought it was going to, to work for me to slip that right out of there, but I'm not having too much luck. 
Let's see. If it... Oh, it's going to go. All right. So it comes in a nice heavy-duty box. The box doesn't look... It looks a little tiny crushed on this little edge, but I don't think that's going to be a problem. Let's see what we got in here. Whoops, don't lose those over a moment, tweezers. You'll be really depressed. Okay, it comes with your basic kit, but it does have some baggies. Little green boat and some... Um, the pink and a three-placer and a long piece of... What do you call it? Wax. Jeez, I can't even think today. Okay, and it does have a plastic cover. I can feel it. Now, this sand did get just a little crushed, but it's not that bad. It's got a really nice uh, smoothie type. It's not smooth like Diamond Art Club, but, you know, I mean, it's not that rough and raggedy thing. You get the beads out of there. And lose the box for five minutes. And this, let me pull this back so it'll lay. And it's a picture of Koi in a pool. Can you see that? It's really sticky. Please complete the torn part in time. Okay, don't know what the heck that means. All y'all. Never heard them say that. And it's got uh, 30 colors to it. I'll peel that back so that I can show you the. Uh, see if I can get the thumbnail there. There's the thumbnail. And while you're there, you can see how clear the the um, canvas is. Really, really super, super sticky. But yeah, and it's supposed to be a 50 by 40. But we know that won't work. And the actual painting is... Let's see here. 42 across. Well, let me lay it down flat. About 42 and a quarter, almost, by 33 centimeters. So that's 13 by what? 13 by, by like 16 and a half. But yeah, it's really pretty. I'll show you the drills here in a minute. Just make sure you get to see it all. Let me see if I can tip that up a little bit. But it's real clear. Real clear. I just thought they were beautiful. Little flowers and stuff that go with them. Let me turn this upside down. And we'll have a look-see at the drills. They It didn't say in the description, but they are round. Hang on, guys. i got to find the edge. Oh, dear. Hang on. Oh, we're going right past it. Try to do it over here so it didn't make so much sprinkling noise. We have some oranges and browns and tans. And I'll just kind of lay them here. Doesn't look like there's a whole lot. Really bright oranges and reds. And then there's some peaches and some bright red. And what is that? Oh, 823. That's that dark blue. And there's a little bit of 310 there. I wouldn't get real excited about the 310. I'll kind of lay them out there, and then I'll move you over here so you can see all the colors. Oops. And there's some uh, 383. I thought that was going to be five, 555. Okay, so now I'm going to turn my light back on. And then I'm going to bring it yeah, over here. Whoops. But yeah, there's a lot of nice, pretty colors in that. Part of them are water. There's no ABs or anything weird. 
That's a pretty color. It's kind of a cranberry. It's real sparkly. And that's 3835. And kind of a, a olive green, if you will. Whoops. But yeah, I just thought they were really pretty. Whoops, my bad. Just trying to bring you up close. So we could kind of do that. But yeah. So that'll give us all something to do. And, and it's not too big or get carry, getting carried away or anything. But I just thought it'd be a nice quickie. It's kind of like the same size as that uh, Geisha girl that I did um, a while back. And it's around, so it's so fairly, fairly smooth. But now I'm getting used to Diamond Art Club and their square drills, so we'll see. You get used to doing one thing and you can go really fast, and others not so much. But uh, I just thought these were pretty. They make a nice little quickie project, you know, to do in between the Diamond Art Clubs. But if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And please hit the bell so you'll know when my next video shows up. And y'all have a great day. God bless. Bye-bye.